Welcome to the channel, Excellence, where he strive for excellence. I strive to be the best that I can. I'm only going to give you the best that I got. I ain't got time to bullshit with nobody. See, I work in spirit. I am spiritual consciousness. See, I'm a spiritual being having a human experience. I'm not a human being looking for something spiritual to tap into so I can turn around and say, I fooled you. I'm a spiritual being upright, independent, and fearless. I do not screen myself for the sake of reputation or fame. And I don't try to defame anyone or have anything against anyone that's for the uplifting of fallen humanity. Because humanity has failed at its greatest heights and has taken on the form of an earthworm. That's how low humanity has gone. You see people walking around, but you don't see nothing but maggots. See, you see the maggots in them. You see people so rotten. Boy, you can see the maggots coming out of their ass. If you don't stand upright, independent, and fearless for the cares of this world, why do you think this world should care about you? We in a new era of time now. This is a new world order now. It's time out for you to see other people's bullshit and not put their ass on blast. See, that's when you tell the truth and shame the devil. Whenever you in a spiritual warfare. Because, no, all wars are going on around you every day. Some of them are mentally challenged. A lot of y'all need to dial 1-800-WORK-ON-MY-MENTAL-HEALTH. Because this world, it's not about racism no more. It ain't no black and white and this, that, and the other. People done got way beyond that. And if you still got racism in your heart, you just downright ignorant. You just an ignorant motherfucker. That's all I like to say. But the cares of this world now is the emotional, mental state of existence. Everybody right now must be emotionally in touch with their spirit and their divine being and their purpose on this plane of things may manifest. Stand in your greatness, stand in your spirit. Like, share, and subscribe. The membership channel is being set up. But like, share, and subscribe. My next stage is setting up the members for the membership so we can really get down dirty and come out squeaky clean. Not try to act like you squeaky clean, but you muddy, bloody, and all messed up. We got a tampon for that one. I come to y'all in love. I leave you in peace. Have a blessed day. Oh, man. Thank y'all so much for being here. This your first time here. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. And also, make sure you hit that notification bell so anytime I go live or drop new content, you could be in tone, man. Remember, all of my messages are timeless. So whenever you hear it, that's when you're supposed to hear it, family. Understand that, overstand that. Whoever I'm speaking to right now, a lot of people, they underestimated who you truly are. Now they see the true you. You are a living earth angel. Everyone feels different when they get around you. That's another reason why people cleanse to your energy because you make them feel a way that they never felt before. You make them see life 
in a different manner that they never seen life before. I'm speaking to somebody that's very, very intellectual. You have a lot of knowledge. You have a lot of wisdom. You have been through the ringer and back. It's like you got so much experience. And a lot of people see you for who you are now. You was recently going through a situation where you felt like people was judging you or people was trying to put you in situations. And they did talk bad about your name and try to make you look like you're somebody that you're not. But I'm here to tell you that everybody see who you are now. Because you live in love and light, because you you never you never judge nobody, because you're not jealous, because you are just so authentic and you love people. People see you for who you are, man. You are a living earth angel. Everyone feels diff a different type of energy when they get close to you. So this is a season where you gotta really, really protect your energy, family. You are attracting so many different types of spirits people, consciousness, energies, vibrations. You need to really make sure that you are protecting your energy at all times. Make sure you are cleansing your energy. Make sure you are meditating because this right here is going to be significant to you for the rest of your life. You are stepping into a different journey than a lot of people has ever seen before. So don't be afraid. It's time for you to take a leap of faith on you and know that the most high... Is using you as a vessel and no weapon form against you wherever possible. I'm speaking to a living earth angel. I say, I'm gonna go ahead and jump right into your message, man. I'm gonna grab a spirit animal oracle card to see what your spirit animals have to say at this time, man. Shout out to my soul family. What's up, a Ashley, Angel Earth, Donald, Sunshine, Destiny, uh, VL, Heart Chakra, 777, Sunshine. Leticia, Echo of God, Don Dada. Shout out to all my soul family, man. I love y'all, man. Anybody want to um, book a personal reading or donate to the channel or book a session to get any CMOS, all my information is in the description, family. This your first time here, make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so anytime I go live, you definitely can be notified, okay? Let's see what your spirit animals have to say to you at this time. Mouse spirit. Tend to the small things. The most high facts to tend to the small things at this time. There's so much changing and you got to start dotting on your knees, family. This is where you got to make sure you're cleansing your aura and releasing things that no longer serve you. I told you, you are stepping into a whole different way of life. It's time for you to cut the people off that need to be cut off. It's time for you to stand up for the things that you say you're going to stand up for. The Most High has asked you to tend to the small things at this time, man. Because I really feel like something is blocking you from being successful. I really feel like a person is stopping you for seeing your validation. The Most High is saying, tend to the small things. You need to see you for who you are. Make sure you're taking care of yourself, sis. Make sure you're taking care of yourself, bro. See, you are a person that a lot of people need your energy. So a lot of people gravitate to you. And I'm going to keep it real. Soon as you get home from your days of work or just, you know, being around people all day, you are drained. You don't have any energy. You got enough energy to, make, to, to take a shower and rest. The Most High said, make sure you're taking care of yourself. Tend to the small things. And also, I'm hearing that, um, if you have something that you need to get started on, you need to get started on that. Stop putting it off into tomorrow. Because you got to understand, tomorrow is never promised. Live in the present. Let me repeat that. Live in the present. The past is gone and the future is not here yet. Make sure you're taking care of yourself, sis. Make sure you're taking care of yourself, bro. You could be 40 years old or your birthday could be in April. You could be a life path number four or you could be born on the fourth of a month. I'm going to grab an archangel card to see what your archangels have to say to you at this time, family. Because this is the season for real, to be honest, you are seeking a lot of guidance now. You are asking more questions than usual now. It's kind of like 
you know, you just in that epiphany stage where you just want to know more. You know, it's starting to get infatuated with you. You know what I'm saying? You're starting to really dig deep into the spirituality. You're starting to really dig deep into your lineage and your family history and who you are. And the Most High said, seek you will find. Be the wise one, man. Make sure you be the wise one. Because the information is out there. But understand that the information can be there. But if you don't acknowledge the information or try to digest the information, then the information is useless to you. You feel what I'm saying? So the most I say, seek, you will find, be the wise one, because you are transforming at this time. Understand it, understand that. Hey, how you doing, beautiful? I see you. Thank you so much for being here. Let's see what your archangels have to say to you at this time. Be conscious. Co cooperate with others for the highest good. The most high say, Co-create with others for the highest good, family. I told you I'm speaking to an earth angel. You are somebody that's very, very loving. You are somebody that's very, very wise. You are somebody that's very empathic. You feel energies. That's another reason why people connect to you because when they get around you, your energy is just so pure, man. They feel you. They can't deny your presence. That's why a lot of people try to discredit you. The Most High says it's time for you to co to co-create with others because you are stepping into a different season in your life. You are transforming at this time. Monarch butterflies can definitely be significant to you. Also bees, if you've been seeing a lot of bees lately, bumblebees, that means a sweet results awaits for you. So with something that you're working on and something that you want, it's starting to fall, it's starting to, you know, find its path to you because you got to understand that everything is like the law of attraction. You know, whatever you want and you you got to put yourself in that right energy to call the frequency back. You feel what I'm saying? So understand that this is a season where you got to make sure that you co-creating with others to reciprocate that same energy that you're giving out to people. Because the most high needs you to tend to the small things. The most high needs you to stop being drained and giving all your energy to people that really don't care about you. The people that the people that supposed to love you, they supposed to pour into you as well. But it's like you just... It's like you've been pouring into everybody's cup, and it's like when it comes down to you, nobody's there to help you. This is why the Most High say, you got to see them for who they are, family. Understand it, understand that, man. If you are receiving this message, I want to see you put them green hearts in the chat. If you are receiving this message, I want to see you hit that like button. Because you know I'm talking to you, sis. You know I'm talking to you, bro. You know it. Shout out to my day ones, man. I really, really love y'all. Let's go ahead and see what the most high have to say at this time. Third eye chakra. I see the wisdom of my higher self and apply the what? Excuse me. I see the wisdom of my higher self and apply this wisdom in my life. You are so tapped in at this time. I told you, you are somebody that's very empathic. You get a lot of intuitive downloads. The Most High said it's time for you to start to embrace the wisdom. Didn't I say, seek you will find, be the wise one? I'm speaking to somebody that's a light worker. You are a light worker, family. Your third eye is, is, is activating at this time. For real, you could definitely be having slight headaches out of nowhere. You're somebody that's, that's, that's always, you know, active. And just out of nowhere, you just start having headaches. And the next thing you know, you just start having anxiety. It's because you are a natural impact. This is a part of who you are. That's why I say it's very important for you to rip, for, for you to do research on how to keep yourself calm. That's why I always say meditation is the key. You are somebody that's empathic. You are empath. Stop acting like you're not. It's very important for you to protect your energy at this time because I'm going to keep it real. A lot of people know who you are because you are the light. Everywhere you go, people can't miss you even if you're trying to hide because the most high anointed you. That's why you must be your authentic self at all times. Tend to the small things. I keep hearing that. Tend to the small things, man. It's something that you need to tend to, that you need to get back to. You need to do that. If it's somebody that you need to make amends with, you need to make amends with that person. If it's an opportunity that's going to present itself, you need to figure out what you need to do to get this opportunity. Whatever it is, I'm hearing that something is holding you back. Physically, mentally, spiritually, or emotionally. From elevating. Because you're not, you're not giving it no type of, um, 
no type of energy. It's kind of like you're in a, you're in the energy right now where you're just cutting everything off. Everybody, every situation. You're not talking to nobody. You're not really texting nobody. You're just kind of to yourself at this time. You know, you might, you know, speak to a few people. Or you might, you know, answer a few calls here or there. But for the most part, you don't deal with a lot of people. That's only because you're going through shadow work. And I need you to understand this too. A lot of people don't, a lot of people not going to get why you got to stay away from them. But the most high saying, make sure you tend to the small things. If the person or people is bringing you negativity, deuces, I'm going to get with you. But if it's something that you must, you know, um, that you must attend to, to release some type of negative energy in a positive manner, then don't block it because of how you feel. The most I say is time to tend to the small things. You know what I'm saying? Use your consciousness. Co-create with others for the highest good. I see the wisdom of my higher self and I apply the, the wisdom in my life every day. That's what the most I say. You got to apply this wisdom in your life every day. If it's somebody that you want to be on good terms, you can't make this person be on good terms. As long as you try to do your best, that's it. Leave it there. Because one thing about it, family, you are the prize. Understand that, overstand that, man. I'm definitely speaking to a psychic, a light worker. You are a reader as well. But it's like people judge you because... Because you are a reader. That's the reason why you really don't talk about it too much. Because you don't like being judged. I'm here to tell you that the most high saying, everybody going to judge you no matter what you do. It doesn't matter if you do good, bad. If you're fine, ugly. If you're fat, skinny. It don't matter who you are. They still going to find something to judge you. So the most high saying, be your authentic self. Stop being afraid of being who you are. Because no matter, no matter if you be who you are, you only take it from yourself. Because they being themselves by judging you. That's who they are. But you can't let them stop you from being successful because you, you, you are, you are kind of like in your feelings about what they're saying. That's their job to destroy you. In order to destroy a chosen one, you must destroy their self-confidence, man. I say this all the time. Because when you destroy your self-confidence, you won't want to become anything. You're going to be sitting here drowning your sorrows looking for validation. So that's why they attack your confidence. This is a season when you got to start seeing through the illusions, man. You're not asleep anymore, man. Your third eye is activating. You're not asleep anymore. You, the veil is up. You definitely could be 24 years old or 42 years old. You could be a life path number six. Your birthday could be April the 2nd or February the 4th. Already we have April out here. Definitely your birthday can be in April or something transpired in April. Maybe you manifested something in April and it's starting to come, in, come into your, you know, in, into your reality. It's kind of scary to you because you can't believe it's showing up at your front door. The most I said, this is what you asked for. Don't be afraid of your blessings. It's just a little hard when you, when you got to trust the unknown. The most I said, you are always divinely guided. Trust the unknown, family. Just because you don't see a way, that don't mean there's not a way. Understand it, understand it. You are somebody that's a, that's somebody that's a higher seer. That's why it's very important for you to be your authentic self because they need you to be the interpreter. It's kind of like you are somebody that, that, that interpret messages very well for people. You know what I'm saying? It's not the point about, you know, you better than somebody or, or you, you just have way more knowledge than somebody. No, you just explain it to people in an orderly fashion where they can understand it. No disrespect, but when you speak your truth and when you teach something, even the most retarded person can understand what you're saying. That's the reason why the Most High chose you, man. It's not about how you look. It's about who you are and your gifts. Understand that, understand that, family. Because you are somebody significant. You are somebody special. I'm speaking to a living earth angel. Everybody feel a different type of energy when they get close to you. So you got to understand that you are a healer. You are designed to be a healer. That's why your heart is like that. This is why every time you turn around, you want to bless somebody. It ain't because, you know, you just some, you just trying to look for cotton. Like, that's just who you are. You don't want to see nobody do bad. So if you can do anything to help them, you will. But some people would take advantage of that. That's why the most I say, use your third eye. Pay attention to all the signs of synchronicity. Because you are around people that's only trying to take from you, man. You're around some people that's really praying on your downfall and they cannot wait. Till you fall and sabotage you. So keep your eyes open. That's what the Most High just said. 
sacred space. I find peace, security when I'm when I'm surrounded by nature. A sacred space. I feel peace, security when I am surrounded by nature. The most high said, you need to get outside, family. Also, I could be speaking to somebody that might be that might stay by a waterfall. You need to go there because it's going to cleanse your aura. It's kind of like getting baptized, but you got to understand that you are the person that can do it for yourself because the most high is within you. You are the person that's supposed to anoint people because you are anointed. That's what I just heard. I told him I'm speaking to an earth angel. The most high gave you these gifts and these powers to use for people good. You're going to cleanse people life. So I really feel like if you live by a waterfall, this message is definitely for you. I'm definitely speaking to somebody that's a healer. The most high is using you, using you in, a, in a miraculous way. Your birthday could be in July or you could be born on the 7th of a month. Remember, take what resonates and leave the rest. If it ain't you, then it ain't you, family. Understand that, understand that. Also, I really feel like that you could definitely feel connected to fairies. Maybe you are somebody that got, you know, that, 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 that you know, may have a fairy tattoo or might have thought you seen a fairy. But I'm going to tell you something. Fairies are very real. People can believe what they want to believe. You got to understand all of these, all of these animals, insects and, 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 and beings that they're trying to come up with. They already been out. They was already here before us. So you got to understand. That you are connected. So whenever you're seeing something, that's because you are in the right frequency to, to receive the information. A lot of people not in that frequency to see, to see something spiritual or get a supernatural experience. But you are because you are in that right vibration. You are raising your consciousness every day. And that's another reason why people, they are afraid of, you know, just, just being in your presence. Because they know who you are now. And also, it's like whenever they see you. You irritate their demons to the point where they stay away from you. Some people do like you, but you make them look at themselves a lot. Because you have came a long way. I told them I'm speaking to a light where I'm speaking to a teacher. It's your job to make people look at life from a different perspective. You are earth angel, family. You are earth angel. Understand it, overstand that, man. Find you a sacred space. Find you a place where you can just feel just alone enough to the, to the point where you can get a peace of mind. Because you are somebody that get distracted easy, man. You got so much going on in your life, you get distracted easy. You'll start doing one thing, the next thing you know, you'll come back to it and it's, it's three days later. You're like, damn, I forgot about this. The most I say, it's time to tend to the small things, man. Stop putting stuff off because... You know, you feel like you don't got enough time. Trust me, everybody got the same amount of time. You got to make some time for it, though. Understand it, overstand it. The healer. I told y'all. I told him speaking to a healer, man. I'm tapped in. You need to hit that like button right now and claim this message, man. The healer. I am loving and compassionate and able to bring healing to others. I could definitely be speaking to somebody that's indigenous or consider themselves to be an Indian or you might have an Indian tattoo. I'm hearing Cherokee. I'm hearing Chakata. I'm hearing Blackfoot. I'm hearing Aboriginals. Somebody that's indigenous to this land. And you starting to realize, you know, that you are the one that they're talking about, the chosen one. You could also have a clear, a clear quartz crystal. The Most High said, make sure you continue to keep um, working with that clear quartz, man, because it's going to bring you balance. It's going to bring you, you know, um, it's going to help you with your anxiety because you be around a lot of people that give you anxiety. It ain't because they're doing something to you. It's because you tap into their energy. I told them I'm talking to an empath. You could be around people and just start feeling crazy for no reason. That's because they got they got demonic spirits attached to them, family. You know what I'm saying? But you are able to pick up on their energy. That's why the Most High said it's very important for you to make sure you cleansing your aura, taking your spiritual baths. You know what I'm saying? Because you are under a lot of spiritual attacks right now. 
You are under a whole lot of spiritual attacks right now, family. And it's very important for you to make sure that you are protecting yourself at all costs. Understand and understand it. Your birthday could be in August or you could be born on the 8th of a month. Or you could be a life path number eight. If that's you, this message is definitely for you, family. At the bottom of the deck, we got Archangel Gabriel. This, not this card, but another card came out yesterday, Archangel Gabriel. Somebody, you feel connected to Archangel Gabriel, man. And don't be afraid to call upon your Archangels because they are here to help heal you and also to defend you. That's why you got to get, that's why your ancestors, all I keep hearing your ancestors say is speak to me. Speak to me. Stop being afraid of speaking to your ancestors. There's nothing wrong with that. It don't make you demonic. It don't make you evil. You are just tapping to a different consciousness, family. The most I chose you, man. You were able to communicate with the spiritual realm. This is why you get these intuitive downloads to bring change to this world. I told you you're an earth angel, man. Remember who you are, family. Archangel Gabriel, I invite Archangel Gabriel to bring hope and initiation into my life. You are being initiated at this time, family. You passed the test. You paid your karmic debt back. Congratulations. I want to say congratulations, sis. I want to say congratulations, bro. Because you've been through a lot. In your life and you still standing you still pushing you still going hard man i promise you a lot of people are looking at you and so mesmerized because they know what you've been through and you still looking good sis you still looking good bro you don't wear your heart in your sleeve you are being initiated at this time you are healing you are healing your family lineage. You are healing your generational wounds. You are healing your generational childhood traumas. The Most High said, invite Archangel Gabriel in your life to help you heal because you are going through initiation at this time. You could be born February the 2nd, or your life path number could be number 4, or you could be born on the 22nd of a month, or you could be 22 years old. That's for somebody specific. Also, you could be a master number 22. If you're a master number 22, this message is definitely for you. You have a big life purpose. You know who you are. That's why it's very important for you to know your life path number so you can understand, you know, the way that you function, the way that you, you know, the, the, the things that you struggle with, your mindset. Anybody want to want to get any uh get a personal reading or um find out what their life path number is, send me a DM, book some time with me, family. I'm here to help you elevate. I'm here to put you in that right, that right state of mind so you can understand why things are happening to you. You know what I'm saying? I'm a guide just like you're a guide. We're here to activate each other. So make sure you reach out to me. All my information is in the description, man. Understand it, understand that. You are being initiated at this time. So continue to heal. Don't be so hard on yourself, family. I could be speaking to an a air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Or you can have an error in your chart. I love you too, beautiful. Thank y'all so much for being here, man. If this is your first time here, make sure you hit that subscribe button. So anytime I go live, you can definitely be in tune. Shout out to my soul family. You are so connected to your angels at this time, I'm telling you. They don't play about you, family. No need to worry about anything. You don't need to worry about anything, family. All you got to do is continue to keep being the best version of you. And stop focusing on what you don't have. Let me repeat that, man. Stop focusing on what you don't have. Because right now, I feel like that you're thinking about finances all the time, man. That's why financial constraints is out here. And also, you got some people that's going through financial constraints because of what they've done to you behind the scenes, I just heard. I don't know if somebody forged your name or somebody stole something from you. They're going through troubles right now. Every penny got to go to a lawyer or something they got to pay because they in debt. While you getting out of debt. That's why I say stop looking at the things you don't have right now, family. You might don't see a way, but trust me, there is a way. It's time for you to get out that poverty mindset. Get out the poverty mindset. Focus on, focus on what you are accomplishing at this time. 
Realize money is an energy. Realize love is an energy. When you feel like you don't have it, then you won't have it. That's why the Most High say, manifest and act as if it's already there, family. Stop focusing so much on the things you don't have. You could definitely be born on the 13th of a month. 444 is definitely significant to you, man. We definitely have that out here. 444. Also, your birthday could be January the 3rd or March the 1st. There is a lot of April out here, man. April is definitely significant to you. I could be speaking to an Aries or a Taurus. Number 13 could be your favorite number because you feel like that's your lucky number. Also, I just heard you can be born on the 13th of a month or you might have a 13-year-old child. If that's you, this message is definitely for you, family. So you in your head, man. Get out your head, family. Stop thinking about the things that no longer serve you. Stop worrying about, you know, things that, that, that's not even here yet. Get out of the future. It's not here yet, family. Yes, I'm on you, sis. Yes, I'm on you, bro. <laughs> you all in your head, man. What, what I'm going to eat in 2024. It's not here yet, man. The most high say live in the present. The most high say continue to heal because you've been initiated. Also work with your crystals because there is a lot of cars out here. We got actually one, two, three cars out here with crystals. So you are somebody that feel connected to crystals. I told you um, a clear course can definitely be significant to you. We have that out here twice. Or a Saturnite. A Saturnite crystal. Understand that Saturnite crystals is a crystal that can charge all crystals. So maybe you feel connected to this Saturnite crystal because you are somebody that recharges a lot of people. You are the charger. Like the Saturnite crystal, man. That's why people cleanse to your energy. I'm telling you, you are a living earth angel. Everyone feels a different energy when they get close to you. You just magnetizing. And people are just so mesmerized of who you are. The most high ask you get out your head, man. Stop thinking about the things that no longer serve you. And I really feel like you just think about money all the time. You're going to be okay, sis. You're going to be all right, bro. You're going to be all right. Sometimes times get hard, but you got to understand every situation is only temporary. Get out of your head and just trust the most high. You could be 46 years old or 64 years old. Also, the people that tried to put you in a, in a financial constraint, this person could be 64 years old or um, 46 years old, I just heard. But you already knew that they was working against you. That's why you got out of there. But the most high needs you to get out your head, though. You are making the right decisions. Continue to keep being the best version of you, family. Your birthday could be April the 6th or June the 4th. I told you, there's a lot of April out here, man. A lot of April. Spring is definitely significant to you. I'm telling you, if you manifested something in the springtime, it is sprouting right now. That's why I say you don't need to worry about money. That's the last thing you're going to need to worry about. I know you want it right now. I know you like, shit, I got bills to pay this month. This month, new month coming up. You don't know my situation. Yes, I do, because we all got bills. We all got situations. But you got to understand, you stay focused on that shit, you ain't going to accomplish nothing. Because you keep thinking about the things you don't have. When the most high say everything is an energy, whatever you want, you can attract. But trust me, confidence is the key to success, though. You can't say you want more money and you're just sitting on your ass all day. It don't work like that, family. You got to take some type of action to get a reaction. And when you take that action, that's that spark of magic that the Most High can work with to bring everything you want into the forefront in your 3D realm. So you need to understand how powerful you are, family. You are. It's time to take a journey. Some of you guys could be traveling soon. It's going to be a safe travel. Don't worry about anything. Don't worry about your safety. Don't worry about your house. Don't worry about nothing. The Most High said, I want you to enjoy yourself because you deserve it, sis. You deserve it, bro. Some of you guys have never been on a vacation. You, you, you do for one. Take it. You've been slaving for a long time at that job, but they still ain't giving you this right support. The most I said time for you to take some time off, man. Gather your thoughts, because I'm speaking to an entrepreneur right now. 
Continue to trust your journey, I just heard. Because you are stepping in through doors that a lot of people have never been through, and they're going to make you feel like you're not worthy for that. That's for somebody specific. I'm speaking to somebody, I really feel like you have a contract coming towards you that's going to change your life. This is why the Most High said, finances don't have to worry about finances. You might feel like you're in finance constraint right now. That's why you're in your head. But when you take this journey, when you take this leap of faith, it's going to bring you so much abundance. You're not even going to worry about anything anymore. That's on everything. You definitely could be a life path number two or born in February or on the second of a month. Definitely could have a two-year-old child. That's another reason why you're in your mind. Because you're like, damn, I got to take care of my kids. I got to pay these bills. I got to do this. I got to do that. Most I say, calm down, man. Peace be still. Meditation brings answers, man. Stop worrying about things that no longer serve you. The most high got you. Sit back and let the most high fix that. At the bottom of the deck, we got storm warning. That's why I say pay attention to your energy, man, because somebody trying to bring you a storm warning. And also I heard that there's a storm warning going on in a lot of people's lives that did you wrong. Some of these people don't even come outside no more. They don't even turn on lights. They're they, 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 they going through a lot of shadow work right now. You might go over their house and their whole house dark. You like, damn, man, can you open up a window in here? Because they're going through karma. They want to get you behind your back. And the most high seen that. That's why it's very important for you to realize that when people get around you, they feel a different type of energy when they get close to you, man. They know who you are. They feel that love. They feel that high vibration. They feel that they're that anointed on your life. And that's why people gravitate to you because a lot, a lot of times... Some people want to take from you because they feel like that you're going to turn the other cheek because you're spiritual or you might be religious. For God, you work for the most high. And people be thinking that, oh yeah, I can just do this to her. I can do this to him. Man, I'm telling you. You think we going to turn the other cheek. You got another day. You got another thing coming, man. Because if you slap me, it's going to be bigger than a storm warning. You're going to draw back a nub. That's on everything. We spiritual warriors, family. We're not here to be misused. We're here to be used as a vessel. Understand that, overstand that. You could be seeing 1010 a lot too. 1010 could definitely be significant to you, or your birthday could be born. I mean, your birthday could be in October. October the 2nd, October the 13th, and you could be uh, 46 years old or 64 years old. If that's you, this message is definitely for you. Also, I'm here in the life path number one. Something is changing in your life right now that's going to propel you on this new journey. You needed some type of confirmation, and now you have it. This is your confirmation. The Most High said, take that leap of faith on what you've been working on for so long. Do not give up at this time, family. Don't give up at this time. Because I promise you, where you're headed, you're not even be thinking about what you're going through right now. In a year time frame from now. That's on everything. Understand it, understand that. If you are receiving this message, make sure you hit that like button. Because I see a lot of people in the chat, man. I know you're not here trolling. It just helps with the algorithm of the, ch of the channel. It don't cost nothing. Thank y'all so much for y'all support. Thank y'all for being here, man. Because you know I'm speaking to you, sis. You know I'm speaking to you, bro. Anybody want to book a personal reading, donate to the channel. Or, um... Follow me on any of my social media platforms. All my, all my information is in, the, is in the description, man. Thank y'all so much. This card right here keeps coming out, family. The temple of truth. Throat chakra. Authenticity. Self-expression. <laughs> it's time to speak your truth. This card came out yesterday, man. It's time to start speaking your truth, family. It's time. Stand up for what you believe in. The most high needs you to be your authentic self. I told you, you are an earth angel, man. You are an earth angel. Speak your truth. Your throat chakra is activating at this time, man. It's time to express yourself because you have a lot of stuff on your mind. And also, you have a lot of wisdom that's being withheld because you're not speaking. The most high said, you need to speak because you are a guide. I told him, speaking to a natural psychic. You always been in tune. 
but people made you feel like that what you feel is wrong. So the, so then you stop trying to feel it. That's why the Most High. That's why the Most High made you see who you are every day. You can't ignore it. You would never see the world ever ever the same ever again, family. It's time for you to be your authentic self and express yourself. Your throat chakra is activating at this time. Speak your truth, family. You already made the decision to. You already made that decision to step into a new way of life. You prayed for it for a new for a new beginning, and it's here. Stop worrying about things that no longer serve you, family. This is your confirmation. Remember, take what resonates and lead the rest. If it's not true, then it's not true, family. Understand that, overstand that. Crown chakra upgrade, divine connection, holy experiences, miraculous energy. I you are somebody that's, I'm telling you. <laughs> the chosen one, man. Earth angel. I'm speaking to the healer of ages, man. You are a natural healer. Your crown chakra is activated. We got the third eye chakra and we got the crown chakra. You are a psyche. You are a tarot reader. You are an empath. You are somebody that step into the spiritual realm. Clear cognate, clear audit, clear, clairvoyant. I just heard. Stop letting people make you feel bad about your gifts. You are the light. The most high needs you to be your authentic self. That's why self-expression is out here in authenticity. Because your crown chakra is giving you intuitive downloads that of information that needs to be heard, man, from your ancestors and from ancient deities. A vessel. A star messenger, I just heard. I'm speaking to a star messenger, man. Doves can be definitely significant to you. You're walking into a lot of divine connections too, so please keep your heart open because I really feel like that you just, you guard it for some reason. You guard it. Oh, you guard it because of what happened to you. You realize that it was more people involved than just that person that you was having an issue with. And you realize from the beginning, everybody was going against you now. This, this right here actually really brought them a storm warning because they thought you would never find out. That is why they thought you would never find out about what they took from you. But your ancestors gave you this epiphany though. And that's what actually activated you to start on your journey. That's why the most I say, don't give up at this time. Get out your head. You are doing the right thing. That shit broke your heart, family. <laughs> I'm not laughing at you because I see how far you came. And I'm telling you, if you don't see that you are being guided in the right direction, family. If you don't see that you're being guided in the right direction, I don't know what to tell you. Because the most high speak to you every day. You are the healer. I'm hearing the, 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 the you starting the lineage over. You are the generational curse breaker. And the generational wealth bringer. I'm hearing the first multi-millionaire. First multi-billionaire. In your family, man. I want to see somebody put in the chat right now. I am the first multi-billionaire in my family. I want to see somebody put in the chat right now. I am the first multi-billionaire in my family. Because I'm telling you. The stars are aligning for you, family. You're about to meet somebody that's going to give you some information that's going to change your life forever. My family. This person will come in real swift, too. You're not even going to expect this. This is going to hit you out of nowhere. That's on everything, family. <laughs> this is all going to hit you out of nowhere. And knock you light codes. Energetic shift, new information, end of cycle. Didn't I just say you about to get some type of information, man? You better hit that light button. I'm so tapped in, man. I'm tapped in. I just said you about to get some type of information. You about to get a message. There's a big shift coming in your life. 
It's time for you to embrace this journey. And understand that the most high is using you, not them, man. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Lost Girl Made Woman, the high priestess, for that donation. Thank you, beautiful. I really, really appreciate you, man. You are getting a lot of divine wisdom at this time. You are getting a lot of divine information at this time, family. You could feel connected to the Anunnaki, man. Also, I, I, I'm hearing that you need to do research on the Anunnaki. That's for somebody specific. Because it's going to dictate your powers and your gifts and it's going to show you who you truly are. You feel connected to ancient deities, man. Rainbows are definitely significant to you. Rainbows are portals. They are stargates. That's why I say the stars are aligning in your life. The stars are definitely aligning, family. Stop worrying about what you lost because you didn't lose anything. It was only meant to teach you a lesson. And if you realize all you got to do is meditate, then you can cleanse that energy and move forward. Don't, don't forget, I'm only here to tell you what you need to know, not what you want to know. I can sit here and tell you what to do all day, but if you don't apply it in your life, then guess what? It ain't going to work for you. I'm telling you, you are somebody that's very empathic. You need to start cleansing your aura, cleansing your energy, man. Shout out to um, Knuckle Child of the Most High for that donation. Thank you so much, family. Peace and prosperity to you. You know I got a special prayer for you. Thank you so much. The most high needs you to believe in yourself, man. Because I feel like you, your confidence, your confidence is a problem right now. It's kind of like, you know, you don't need nobody to tell you that you're beautiful or handsome. It's kind of like because you don't see the outcome of things that you're working on, it's putting you in a situation where, you know, you just always in your mind. That's why I say stop focusing on what you don't have right now. You might only have $100 right now, but you don't understand that Tomorrow, the next day, the next day after that, you could be a millionaire. You got to put yourself in that right energy, family. Let me repeat that. You got to put yourself in that right energy. You got to get out your head at this time. You got to get out your head at this time because I really feel like that you bringing your own self storm warnings because you, you fearful. The most I say, stop being fearful about your journey because you are always divinely protected. 144 likes as I'm saying that, family. I'm speaking to the chosen one. You are fighting a lot of abandonment issues right now. That's another reason why you're scared to take a leap of faith. You're going to be okay, family. Just think about it. Your whole life you've been by yourself. When you take this leap of faith, you still going to be by yourself. You ain't losing. <laughs> the only difference is you're going to be away from the people that you love, that's going against you. That's the only difference, family. The most high needs you to take this leap of faith because I'm speaking to a healer. You have a big mission. You are a living earth angel. Everybody feel a different type of energy when they get next to you. I told you, you are. I'm speaking to somebody that's meant, designed, born to heal people's lives, man. Physically, mentally, spiritually, and emotionally. Everybody got different skills. Everybody got different gifts. But you are a healer, though. Understand it, understand that. At the bottom of the deck, we got third eye activation, bra chakra, inner vision, clear seeing. We got third eye out here twice. You see clearly now, family. Use your intuition at all times. The door is open. You got to walk through it, though. You ask for more information. You ask for a better way of life. You ask to be shown your gifts and your abilities. The most I say, walk through the door. Stop being afraid now. Stop being afraid because you're losing everybody. That's because you're about to gain everything. Stop being afraid because you don't got no support. The most I say, divine connections are here, man. All you got to do is believe in you and realize that you are everything. And a lot of people, they trying to be you, man. 
believe in yourself, sis. Believe in you, bro. Because I'm telling you, you you are getting a lot of downloads, man. You definitely have a trouble resting at night. I told you, slight headaches can can definitely be going on right now as we speak, actually. You could have a headache right now. Because not only are you in your head, you're getting a lot of downloads. You're getting a lot of messages from your ancestors. That's why you got to get out of nature. That's why you got to cleanse your aura. You are needed, family. I'm speaking to a light worker, a tarot reader, Reiki healer. It's you. Walk through the door, family. The most I say answer the call, man. The most I say answer the call. I want to see somebody put in the chat right now. I'm answering the call. If you serious about being successful, if you really, really want to have this, this new beginning, I want to see somebody put in the chat right now. I'm answering the call. I'm answering the call. That's why the most I say tend to the small things, man. Tend to the things that you got to get rid of out of your life. Tend to the things that you need to make amends with. Tend to the things that's slowing you down. At this time, you need to tend to the small things. It's time to answer the call. I'm hearing last call. Last call. It's kind of like you, you stepping into a new journey. So it's going to be their last call with you, man. This their last call for alcohol, man. They don't got no more chances. That's it. Deuces. I'm going to get with you. Plain and simple, family. Plain and simple. Last call, man. You are accelerating. You are ascending. Your spirit team, they are giving you so many intuitive downloads. Also, they are always around you, man. Stop worrying about your protection. If you're seeing 444 a lot, I'm telling you, they don't play about you, sis. They don't play about you, bro. They don't. They are here as we speak right now. I'm feeling a power couple. I just got hot all of a sudden. You got some ancestors. You got, you got a grandma and a grandfather that passed away, and they still together, and they go hard for you, man. That's for somebody specific. I'm hearing the name Lil Bit. They might have called you Lil Bit. Somebody used to be called Sun Sun, I just heard. Maybe that's what your granddaddy used to call you. Continue to keep working hard on what you focused on right now. Don't give up on the things that you're trying to manifest because like I said, you don't see the outcome. Work hard, man. The only thing that comes to a sleeper is a dream. The only thing come to somebody sitting on the couch is TV. That's it. You're not making no money. You're not doing nothing successful. You're not changing your lives or the people around you. The most I said, continue to keep working hard, man. Focus on your craft. Confidence is the key to success. Come out every day. I don't care if you don't see the support right now. The most I say, keep coming out on them. They can't miss you. They won't miss you. Because everybody... Understand that, overstand that. You are definitely somebody that's getting some intuitive downloads about your finances, man. It's very important for you to meditate. I'm going to tell you, this is your confirmation, man. You can listen to it or not. Because I'm just feeling the urge to get on you, sis. Get on you, bro. Because there is so much information dealing with your finances. You have so many ideas or so many ways of doing things to bring you multiple income. If you just sit there and, and, and focus... You got to focus, sis. You got to focus, bro. Nothing is going to happen overnight. Understand and overstand it. Stop worrying about what you don't have. Pay attention to what you can do and what you do have. Gratitude is the best attitude, family. Gratitude is the best attitude. 
Because the pinnacles that you're working on right now is going to make you a multi-billionaire, I just heard. You don't understand the type of money you're coming into. You've been broke all your life. You, ne you never even had no type of money. You probably somebody that never even had $100,000 before. Somebody show you $100,000, you think you rich for real. When the whole time, $100,000 ain't nothing, fam. Just enough to get you set up to get caught up. That's why it's very important for you to pay attention to who you are and your talents. Because your gift and your abundance is infinite. Multi big in that status. It don't stop when it come down to you, family. It don't stop, man, because you are transforming. I told you, there's a lot of cycles changing in your life. A lot of things changing. A lot of cycles are closing with people, places, and things. It's death to these karmics, man. Especially if they did graveyard rituals on you or they wish death on you. I'm telling you, their days are numbered. The Grim Reaper looking for their ass. They should have never did spell work. They should have never dabbled in dark magic. They didn't, and I'm gonna keep it real though. The person that you was dealing with, this ex, this twin flame, or, or this fake soulmate, this person didn't even fucking know what they was doing. They was just doing magic because of what their family was thinking that they, they were doing the right shit the whole time. They was casting spells on their life, dumbass. <laughs> That's why I say sometimes it pays for you to be quiet and just play dumb. Because one thing about a narcissist, somebody that live in demonic energy, they're going to set themselves up. That's on everything. Anything they took from you, I promise you, you're going to get that back. And I really feel like that somebody stole, somebody tried to steal like some finances from you, though. That's another reason why that, that finance constraints out here, too. Because they could have stole your inheritance. Or they could have stole something that you were working on, maybe your idea or something like that. I really feel like maybe you you are somebody that started something and somebody tried to say that they was the originator of it, but they see they being seen as a liar now because the things that they working on is not successful. They constantly focusing on you. How can you be somebody that started something but you focus on me every day, man? I'm gonna tell you something. A lot of these people being exposed because they was being there was a liar from the beginning. You dealt with somebody that was a whole demon. And they dressed it up so nice. You knew this person had mental problems, man. You just scratch your head and be like, man, are you bipolar or something? The whole time is because they they karmics. They can't think on their own, man. But you knew that, though. That's the reason why you went through all the shit you went through, too. Because you thought you could change this person. You thought that you can heal this person. But you got to understand, just because you are a healer, they got free will. They got to want to heal themselves. And you see what happened when you give too much leverage? <laughs> they bite the hand they, that fed them. And that's what happened to you. They bit you. They try to act like that you, that you wasn't worthy or you wasn't the gift or you wasn't that, that person. If you wasn't that bitch or that you wasn't that nigga, they try to act like that you wasn't shit, family. When the whole time you are the shit. Every night they think about you. Because you was the best thing that ever happened to them. That's on everything. You was the best thing that ever happened to this person. They don't know what to do without you. Everybody in their family turned on them. Everybody in their friend circle turned on them because they know that they, they, they see that they was really evil. See, they, was, they, they should do this shit. They, been, they was hiding who they was for so long. They've been getting away with this shit for years and years, man. I already feel like somebody could have got catfished. You could have got catfished by your ex-lover. Or somebody that you used to date. You could have got catfished by this person, man. The whole time they was dating you to set you up. But I'm going to keep it real. Your energy is so, is so pure. Your energy is so loving that the, 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 the enemy, the demonic spirit, fell in love with the earth angel, man. <laughs> you see how the most high work? <laughs> All praise to the most high. You see the most high work, man. The person that was sitting in your life to destroy you fell in love with you, man. <laughs> they fell in love with you, sis. They fell in love with you, bro. And I promise you, they are transforming their life because of you. They know that you're the real deal. They know that you're the only one that was that was that really loved them for who they was and not for what they got or who or what they had or, or type of popularity or or whatever for their body. You love them for them. And they see that now. Because everybody that's, that's in their life right now is taken from them. 
They don't know what to do without you, sis. They don't know what to do without you, bro. That's from everything. They in their head. And while they in their head, you transforming in front of their eyes. So many people are so mesmerized about your glow up. It's like you came up overnight, family. People thought they knew you, but they realized that they don't know nothing about you at all, man. They really thought they knew you, family. They're like, well, shit, she ain't gonna do nothing. He ain't gonna make no money. Because they judge you from your current circumstance. Because maybe you was homeless or you was fighting, you know, uh, fighting with finances at the time. Or, or maybe you got sick or maybe you got heartbroken. They judge you off that situation instead of understanding that every situation is only temporary, man. That's why the most I say, you got to see people for who they are. If you realize when you stop pouring into people, when you stop, when you start telling people no or you stop giving money up, they don't even call you no more. That's how you know that they was using you, man. You know that. That's why the most I said, keep working hard because you are transforming. You are transforming. And now they know that they lost the best thing that ever happened to them. So now they're trying to work hard to get back into your energy. And the most I said, be careful of the people that's come back from your past because they got a secret agenda. They got a secret agenda, family, because they like them. I don't want her to have this without me. He can't be successful without me. You got people that think they made you. <laughs> I just heard I made her. <laughs> I made him. Somebody could have told you that all the time. You are nothing without me. <laughs> and now they see they every, they, now they see that you everything without them. <laughs> you are the catch because you've been the catch. Understand that, overstand that. The most I say, rest. And then I tell you that somebody, somebody that did graveyard ritual magic, they, they days are numbered, family. This your confirmation. Somebody about to pass away soon, man. Remember, take what resonate and leave the rest. Or somebody just passed away. Or you're gonna get a message about somebody passing away, family. Because I'm feeling sick. Somebody's sick. I'm giving cancer. Somebody got cancer, man. That person that was doing spell work. I'm hearing sexual, sexually transmitted diseases as, as, as well. For an ex of yours, a karmic. They thought they could step out on you and the most high gave them something. <laughs> you see what happened? Your ancestors and your sitting mass and the, the most high don't play about you, yo. They don't play about you. They like, oh, you gonna are you gonna step out on my chosen one and act like this person ain't shit? Alright, well go ahead and sleep with that person if you want to. They got that as I die slowly, man. They got that as I die slowly, man. <laughs> Remember, take what resonate and leave the rest. They wish they was dead. Because they know they're going to die. At the bottom of the deck, we got, look, look. Man, you better hit that tower. You better hit that, that like button, man. Tower moment to these karmics, man. The most high not playing with these people. We got storm on it and we got tower out here. Man, don't be surprised if somebody called you crying this week. Man, I knew that I did, I, I did what I did. That was wrong, man. I just thought that, you know, can, can you help me? Man, listen, the most I say, the people that went against you, leave them there. Because it's your time now. Remember, they was having fun when you was hurting. Now that you're happy, you need to have fun. Understand that, overstand that, family. Live your life to the highest ability because you don't need to worry about this past situations no more. These people that was in your past, these immediate family or people that you consider family, or friends, or lovers, they ass is going to be stuck in poverty. They should have never stole from you. And I'm hearing somebody could be losing a house. Maybe it's your house that they stole, and they could be losing it because you're getting it back. Some They are in financial constraints, man. That's why they need you. Don't be surprised somebody call you and be like, man, look, I just want to talk to you. No, because they broke. You was the best thing that ever happened to them. They thought they could get better. So now guess what? They stuck now. The most I say, let them let them let them get their karma. Because one thing about karma, she don't miss no addresses. 
and they addresses has been called. Deuces, I'm going to get with you. Come on your head tenfold, man. I'm telling you, the most high your ancestors, they don't play about you. They don't play about you, sis. They don't play about you, bro. Because you got a big mission. You somebody that's important, man. I'm telling you what I know. You are very important. You just don't know it yet. You don't know it because of the way people treat you. But you will find out. So when you take this leap of faith and you walk on this journey and you start trusting the process and answer this call, I promise you, you're going to be like, damn, I should have been there, this. I should have been believing myself if I knew it was going to be this easy. I'm telling you, the most high got, a, got the road laid out for you, man. I'm hearing red carpet vibes, man. Man, you better remember who you are, royalty. Let's see what else message your, your spirit team have to say. Then I tell you, look, you are so tapped in, and also, you are old soul, like I said. You get into the messages. You've been doing this for lifetimes, man. And also, I hear that this karmic, this fake twin flame, or this soulmate, they've been following you for lifetimes. They've been trying to destroy you. But your energy can't be destroyed because you because you peer. This lifetime, you're going to get it right, family. You passed the test. But you've been fighting a lot of spiritual battles for a lifetime. You've been preparing for this very moment right here. You can have a pyramid tattoo or you feel connected to pyramids. Egypt can be significant to you. Also, make sure that you pay attention to your sun sign, too. Because that's going to actually start giving you some, some, some information on who you truly are. Because I could definitely be speaking to an earth sign, man. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. It's your job to have the, the finer things in life, man. Shout out to, um, to Lord Abdullah for that, for that um, cash app. Peace of prosperity, you family. Thank you so much for your donation. You know I got a special prayer for you. I say, I told you, you've been doing this for lifetimes, man. This is who you are. It's time to speak your truth. It's time to speak your knowledge. It's time to speak these healing words, these vibrations, these frequencies you put out into this universe because your services are needed. You are old soul. You are old soul, family. You could be born on the 14th of a month or you could be a life path number five. Also, your birthday could be January the 4th or April the 1st. If you are receiving this message, I want to see you hit that like button, family. Also, make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell. So anytime I go live, you can be in tune. I'm speaking to an old soul, man. I'm telling you. Old soul. Did I say earth sign? Man, you listen, man. You better, I'm so tapped in. Didn't I say earth sign? <laughs> I know what the most high is showing me. I know what my ancestors are showing me, man. The same thing that the most high in your ancestors are showing you. You are not crazy, family. You are tapped in. The things you say, you say it before it happens. And that's why people get mad because you really know. It's very important for you to get out of nature, man. Connect to the earth. Take your shoes off. Walk in the water. Walk in the sand. Walk in the dirt, man. The grass. Sit under a tree. Hug a tree. Because it's going to help you with your anxiety, man. You could definitely be a life path number, number 11, master number. Also, your birthday could be January the 1st. You could also be a life path number two, I just heard. Also, I'm hearing November the 14th. That's for somebody specific. That date is significant to you, so make sure you mark that date. November the 14th, I just heard. Mark this date because it's going to be significant to you. It's all going to make sense in a couple months, I just heard. November the 14th. That's for somebody specific, man. Remember, take what resonates, leave the rest. If it ain't true, it ain't true. It could be your birthday, or it could definitely be something that you did last November the 14th, or it could be significant this November the 14th. But I already feel like there's something that's going to come to you this November the 14th. So make sure you write your calendar. I mean, mark your calendars, man. Also, around that time, you know, that's a lot of demonic energy around that time, too, from October to December. So make sure that you're cleansing your aura and also make sure that, you know, you are you are protecting your energy, man. That's when a lot of rituals and bad spell work be coming in around that time. 
I'm just here to tell you what you need to know, not what you want to know. But that date is significant to somebody. Because 111 is out here. We got to transmute. The most high needs you to transmute your energy. Because you are somebody, I told you, you are an empath. You are a healer. A Reiki healer is that. You can touch somebody and then they healed. You need to reciprocate your energy. We need to hear from you, sis. We need to hear from you, bro. We need your knowledge. We need your wealth. We need your information. We need your experience. Also, I heard, watch out for the snakes in the grass, man. Make sure you keep your grass cut because somebody lurking in the scenes. That's why I say, this, this, I'm feeling this, this, this X or this toxic family when you stop dealing with it's going through karma right now. They lurking. So keep your grass cut. You can forgive somebody, but release them though. That's what I just heard. Release them. Definitely be 44 years old. We got 444 out here again, man. That's crazy. We got six fours out here, man. This your confirmation lets you know you are divinely protected and you are walking into a stable life. Let me repeat that. You are walking into a stable life, a wealthy life. Understand that, overstand that, man. Six fours make three eights. Eight, eight, eight. Eight, eight, eight is significant to you. It stands for abundance, wealth. All the signs of synchronicity is out here. The most high needs you to trust the process at this time. Understand that you are getting a lot of divine wisdom that's going to help you on your life purpose. But you got to want to receive the information though. We got free will, family. We got free will. Know that. At the bottom of the deck, we got, look, jealousy. You got people, these people jealous, man. This ex, these family members, your job, your neighbors. People that you cool with, they jealous because you glowing right now. And you shine so bright that every time people get around you, they got to put on shades. All eyes on you, man. I'm hearing Tupac. All eyes on me. Everybody watching you. Everybody want to be you, man. You are the prize. You are the catch. You are the one to beat. That's why people are jealous. You could be 23 years old, or you could be born on the 23rd of a month, or this jealous individual could be born on the 23rd of a month. Jealous ass. Or you could be 32 years old. Also, you could be a life path number five, I just heard. Your birthday could be February the 3rd or March the 2nd. Please be aware of the people trying to come back in your life because you are a living earth angel. Everyone feels a different type of energy when they're around you. They feel an energy they never felt before. That's why so many people are mesmerized at who you are. They want to know you. When people meet you one time, they just get obsessed. They got to know more about you. They want to know where you stay. They want to know what you're doing. They want to know who you dating. Like it's, it ain't because, it's some people that's really being nosy, but it's just you mesmerize people. And that's another thing that make people jealous because you are somebody that don't even got to try to get a man or try to get a woman and get all of them. And the people that's trying, they wearing jewelry, makeup, and all this shit, they ain't getting nobody but people that's going to disrespect them. That's why they jealous of you because you natural. You might wear some eyeliner, maybe some lip gloss, and that's it. You get an edge up, bro, you good, man. They still on you. Because you're an earth angel. The most high designed you like that. That's why a lot of people jealous because they like, damn, I want to be her. I want to be him. But if they really understand who they was, they'll realize that they are you. Because we are as one. The more we come together, the more the, the vibration is higher and more powerful. But that's why I say you got to separate from people that's not on your consciousness, man. The most high said, deuces, I'm going to get with you. Plain and simple. It's time for you to be aware of everything that's going on in your life right now. Your third eye is activating at this time. Your penile gland. Your crown chakra is it pulsating. You be feeling that. You be feeling your heart beating in your head sometimes because you're getting so many downloads. You need to release this tension that you have in your life right now. Get outside because I'm telling you, nature will soothe you. Nature will soothe you. Also, I just heard that maybe you might have a pet snake as well, too. Because you feel connected to the snake because you understand that 
the um when they talk about this kundalini energy, energy it's about it's, it's, it has something to do with your spine and if you take off the limbs of a human body and just leave the spine in the head it resembles a snake that's why a lot of ancient deities use snakes because it, it's, it definitely talks about your chakras and being in alignment you know what I'm saying? This is the information that you probably just discovered. So continue to keep seeking and finding information. And also stop being so hard on yourself. You're not going to know everything in one day. Remember, experience is the best teacher, family. You have to experience in order to have knowledge. And once you have knowledge, you turn that to wisdom. And once you have that wisdom, you are able to transmute that energy to share it to the people that needs to process the information, family. I told them I'm speaking to a light worker, a healer, a natural healer. You do this without you don't you you heal people without trying. 179, 179 can be significant to you. 179 can be significant to you. It's time for you to realize that the things that you've been asking for is only because you've been doing this in your past life. You didn't just wake up and say, I want to be a music star out of nowhere. You didn't just wake up and say, oh, I'm, I'm supposed to be the, the, the best basketball player in the world. I'm supposed to be the number one pick actress or actor. You don't just wake up one day and just feel like that and then you really feel in your soul that's who you are. It's because you've been that. You've been this motivational speaker. You've been this nail tech. You've been this healer. You've been this inventor, this creator. This who you've been. And so many people came from your past life to try to destroy that. But they only ran into karma. Because now that you know who you are, your ancestors and your angels can help you. Because you got to understand, we have to ask them to help us. They can protect us, but helping us in our everyday life, we have to invite them into our space. That's why I keep saying, talk to your ancestors, your sending masters, man. They're here to help you. Understand that, overstand that, family. If you are receiving this message, I want to see you hit that like button. And also make sure you hit that subscribe and that notification bell. So anytime I go live or drop new content, you can be in tune. Anybody want to book a personal reading, book a session with me, get any CMOS, donate to the channel. All my information is in the description. Make sure you follow me on all of my social media platforms. Please be aware of the scammers, man. I would never reach out to you first. If you see my picture on somebody else's name, you know that's not me, man. They put my picture on female names, men names, dog names, horses names. Like, they just using my picture for everything. So I must be doing something right, fam. So please don't, you know, get caught up in the scamming. I'm telling you, I would never reach out to you first. So in order to book a session with me or get some information to put you on the right way of life or to put you you know in that right space in your journey you need to get in contact with me first family understand it understand it you can go ahead and think about your question that you want clarification on i'm gonna pull an angel answer card to give you that clarification so whenever you have that question go ahead and put your green hearts in the chat so i can begin family shout out to my soul family shout out to my day ones shout out to everybody who donated to uh, my channel also everybody who's sitting them cash apps thank y'all so much it means so much to me, man. I got the best soul family in the universe. Remember, the energy is always going to be reciprocated. So the more you support me, the more I'm going to support you, family. Understand that I'm always going to come out for you. Continue, continue to support me. Continue to rap with me. I'm telling you, we are making a change. Your time is now, family. Understand and understand that. Okay, I'm seeing the green hearts in the chat right now, so let me go ahead and get started. Spirit, ancestors, guides of the highest white light, please give me a clarification for my soul family. Okay, the most high say, ask for a sign. <laughs> I mean, excuse me, ask your angels. So ask for a sign too. I don't know why that, why, why that popped in my head, but that means ask for a sign, but ask your angels is out here. Didn't I tell you to communicate with your angels? I'm so tapped in, man. I just told you that. <laughs> this is what I do, family. The most high say, ask your angels. You're going to have everything you need, family. I hope this message helped you. 
Thank y'all so much for being here. Shout out to my soul family. I love y'all, man. Until next time. Peace.